He was a simple pencil, with simple dreams and simple desires. He had spent his whole life within boxes. He liked to pass the time by counting the seconds. Soon, the seconds turned to minutes, the minutes into hours, and the hours never ended. Until the day his life changed, that was the day he met her. Who was she? He didn't know. Where did she come from? He didn't know. Did she notice him? He sure hoped so. She looked beautiful. Exactly seven and a half inches long, an unused eraser, and stunning straight edges. He rolls over to meet her. What could he say? Apparently, she thought the same things. This was it. This was love. He no longer needs to count the seconds. He only counted them when he wasn't with her. Everything was per- uh-oh. What was this? He watched as he was ripped away from his love, and now he had nothing. Nothing but time. He counts the seconds again. Days pass, and he was sad. Then he found something new. He wanted to know what it was. Without the help, he couldn't tell. Then he started going towards it. The sharpener eased the pain. He made everything feel so distant. He loved it. His love, the loneliness, the suffering gone. Now, it was just him and the paper. The joy didn't last long. The paper started to hurt him as more and more of him was scraped away. He saw the foreign marks he was making. What did they mean? He hated this now. He wanted the sharpener back. He needed to be sharp again. His wish came true, another hit. It was perfect again, but it wasn't long until he wanted another, and another, and another. He knew it was bad for him, but he still wanted, nay, he needed it. But instead, he was forced into his slavery, writing and writing, never ending. No rest, no sharpener, no time to count the seconds, just work. And then it happened. Ouch! It's back to the sharpener now, but wait, why was he just sitting here? Who was that? Was this it? Replaced, sad, and in pain. He wanted the sharpener. He wanted to see his love again, but he couldn't. There's the sharpener again. Perfect. It doesn't have the same effect, but he still needs it. Back to work. Nothing he wasn't used to now, then it stopped. So this was it. No more love, no more work, no more sharpener. Just time now. He begins to count the seconds to pass the time. But soon, the seconds turn to minutes. The minutes turn to hours, and the hours never ended.